All right, guys, it's Kin Tips here. Today we're doing a review for The Incredible Adventures of Van Helsing. This is free on the Xbox Games Gold. And um, let's, uh, it's loading right now. So uh, the game, I believe, was about six gigs, give or take. Um, these are so many patches you got to download now. So, and it's still loading. All right, almost there, guys. There we go. So new core games. Let's see. Skip cutscene. All right. So I'm gonna do a, like I said, a quick review of this game. Give you guys an idea what it's like. If it's worth. Um, single player. What the hell? What the? You need a character level of 27 to get into scenario. Restart story and face extreme challenge. You must finish story at level 30 to unlock this game mode. What the hell? All right, here we go. I came to Borgovia to free the land from the tyranny of mad science. All right. If this was like any other Van Helsing game, I'm pretty sure it's like a top-down view, sort of like a Tomb Raider Temple of Osiris. That's what I'm thinking. Um, yeah. The music's not bad. Yeah, it's top down view. <laughs> so that uses up your magic meter, as you can see on the left bottom there Here they come This facility is swarming with abandoned So think of uh, Diablo that's pretty much what this game's like I came only for the cultists Yeah So the game's graphics does the job. Um, gameplay is actually kind of boring. Um, and you walk really slow. More rage. I wish you could move a little faster. Why are 
mad scientist so obsessed with underground labs? They have the brains, but they lack the imagination. And I beg to differ. Fumigati's creatures show plenty of imagination. In that case, they're just traditionalists. Yeah, so um, I'm not gonna play through this game. I need to make room on my hard drive. So this game is um, it's all right. I'll give it a six out of ten. It does the job, but I'm not gonna spend hours playing this game. And it's a slowdown too. Crazy. Um, all right, guys. If you have any questions, comments, post below, or subscribe to.